Hey, welcome to InfoGamer. In the previous video, we showed you what a death zone does and what on trigger enter does. We want to show you how on trigger exit might be better for your death zone in this video. So right now we already have a death zone with a script, with a box collider, and a sphere that has a rigid body to react to the death zone. Let's open up the script in Microsoft and we'll change this to on trigger exit. And if you don't already have the code, type in the rest of the code here. Hit control S to save, back to Unity, and we'll want to increase our death zone volume to 60 to already have the game object inside. Then we hit play, and as soon as the game object exits the death zone, it will be deleted. This has a benefit if you have a character that can shoot bullets all over the place. If they can shoot them up or shoot them sideways, as soon as it leaves the volume of the death zone, they will be deleted and your game processor won't have to track the positions of all these random bullets. So thanks for watching this. We hope this helped and, and hope you guys can mess around with on trigger enter and on trigger exit to see what works best for you and your game. Thanks again and we'll talk to you guys later.